I formed the PCOS Foundation in 2010 because of the lack of information out there for the women that were, should be diagnosed. So we do a lot of events, we do a symposium every year, and we have a 5K fun run walk. And we have support groups, we have lunch and learns, and a lot of different things that we're trying to be active with spreading that awareness. And what I found is by being able to provide that information for these women that should be diagnosed or are getting diagnosed, it's helping them change their lives. They're able to get healthier and lower a lot of the risk factors. The risk factors are diabetes, heart attack, endometrial cancers, and strokes. And so by learning information of how to manage PCOS, well, first of all, getting the diagnosis, and then after you get that diagnosis, learning how to manage PCOS, you can lower, in most cases, eliminate those risk factors. Our mission is to spread education and awareness in the communities to help these women and young girls get diagnosed and learn how to manage PCOS. Learn more about PCOS, polycystic ovarian syndrome, on our website at www.pcosfoundation.org. Take a step, take a stand.